So we need a different method. <clears throat> So, we, so here we have isolate the exponential um, all steps for solving exponential equations. Notice it says with unlike basis. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to isolate the exponential expression, multiply the common log on both sides, simplify using one of the properties that I have listed over here, and solve for the variable. So if you notice, this is my exponential part, and it is by itself. So we can go to step two, which is to multiply by the common logarithm, or you can multiply by the natural logarithm. So I'm going to go ahead and multiply by natural log of 4x is equal to natural log of 15. So we have to multiply it on both sides. Now we can apply one of these properties, and the property I'm going to apply is um, we can use the par rule and bring the x to the front. <clears throat> so I can use this property here. So I'm going to have <clears throat> x natural log of 4 is equal to natural log of 15. Divide by natural log of 4. So we get x will be approximately. So we can use our calculator. And we have natural log of 15 divided by natural log of 4. Enter. So this is approximately 1.953. So let's go on to um, the next one, number five. So first you can check, can you make 134 have base five? And in this case, we cannot. So we're going to multiply by natural log on both sides. I'm going to use the par rule and bring the x to the front since it's an exponent and divide by natural log of 5. If you're using um, web assign and it wants an exact answer, then you would enter natural log of 134 divided by natural log of 5. If it wants a decimal, an approximation, then you can put that in your calculator natural log of 134 divided by natural log of 5 and the answer would be approximately 3.043 for letter C we have 10 raised to the power of x. So you can still use um, natural log, but notice that the base is 10. So I'm just going to use the log with base 10. So we can bring x to the front. Divide by log 10. And so we get x is equal to log 8,000 over log 10. That's your exact answer, the approximation. Yeah. 3.903. And if you use natural log, you would still get the same answer. Natural log of 10 to the x is equal to natural log of 8,000. Bring the x to the front. Divide by natural log of 10.
put it in the calculator. And so we get the same um, answer. So you can use natural log or logarithm, uh, whichever log you prefer.